legendary Marv one of the world famous fat killers. I don't know if you ever heard of him, but he battled, he battled Eminem. That's a pretty good guy, man. One of my best friends in the world, man. So this battle is going to be a freaking breeze. Question, Makodia. I'll let you in on it's a secret. I know we're supposed to be nice to each other. I'm flipping the script. I am exposing everything that I've wanted to expose for the past 20 years of this so-called friendship. He's the best actor I've ever known in my life. I, I don't, he's literally Dr. Evil, man. Like, it's, it's, it's crazy. So I'm, I'm taking this chance. I'm gonna do, I'm gonna jump on a grenade for the world and save them so they don't have to deal with it. The nicest we're in Brooklyn. Make some noise, everybody. Yeah. What we have right now isn't just an ordinary battle. We have a certified classic <laughs> that's so long in the making that the world isn't ready for what it's about to see. So without any further ado, battler, to my left, introduce yourself. Okay, Cody, want to see him? Cody, act like you know me. Click the pile if you shit file. Detroit, we in this bitch now. Yeah. Battler to the right, introduce yourself. Question, Cody's biggest fan. <laughs> Marv one. I'm from the east side of Detroit. Yeah. Love that. Have you guys decided who, who you want to go first? You know who you want to go first? I mean, if you, you, you want, I, I could go first. If you I don't want, want you to go first. Well, I'm going to go first. But I don't, I don't want to go first, but, but I don't want you to go first. But if you want me to go first, like, but, like if, but if you don't want to go first. But I don't want you to go first. But if you don't want to. I don't want you to go first. I don't want you to go first. Yo, man, it's a nice sweater. Yeah, thank you. Yeah, it's nice. Thank it's you. dope. What is that? What the fuck is it made out of? I got you. I got you, B. I got you. I got you. Put your fucking hands Watch up. Watch your mouth. Yo, yo. Remember when you went pescatarian and lost all that weight? Yeah. That's when I knew you had the vision. But it was mixed feelings. Because I was happy for you, but I was jealous of your metabolism. <laughs> So that's when I tried to roll. I put aside all my pride and woes, cause you was the blueprint. And all I wanted to do was spit tighter flows and fit tighter clothes. <laughs> Look, you, <laughs> you settled down with a good woman. You stopped dealing with the trifling hoes. This is facts. At the sushi restaurant we go to, they even put his name on the spider roll. Nigga, you, this is Cody. This it's, Cody. That doesn't exist. You, <laughs> you got so much pull and drive that you should have been a tow truck. Yeah, yeah. Get off it. Get off it. Sorry. When you get booked, 99% of the time, your opponents sit at home and think of reasons why they shouldn't show up. It's because they sweet as candy. M&M's, the brown bags, they got no nuts. <laughs> it's a motion picture whenever bro on the set. Don't y'all see the glow on them? Show sure enough. Hey look, remember, remember when you talked to that director and got me that movie role? Dinner in America is on Amazon right now. That was groovy bro. <laughs> Fucking team player. Always equipped with the assist like Rubio. I say fucking team player. Always quick with the assist like, like Rubio. Well versed. He's always down to talk about what or who he know. He sets the path that all the lost boys follow him like Rufio. The ladies say he electric. He make their hair stand up. Not a Coolio. <laughs> they get drunk off his presence. In the girl group chat, they nicknamed him Don Julio. They got M MC of the year. I dare you to find one where he's second best. When we're talking about the greatest of all time, it comes down to him and Jay-Z. And with Jigga, I'm getting less impressed. Now, <laughs> now, 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 Hove is hella fresh. But have you heard him? It's gonna make you second guess. So if I had a vote for the GOAT, then you know. Yes, it's Quest. Round. Let's go.
Round one is on Quest for Cody. Talk nice to me. Talk nice to me. Oh, man. Out nice me. That was good. That was excellent. Man, I got to represent. <laughs> man, I'm just taken aback by those raps. <sighs> I'm nervous, y'all. Relax. <laughs> Trying to keep my shit intact. <sighs> Don't cut me no slack. Wrong? Can I rap? Please. You have one of the greatest minds <laughs> in battle rap. No, no, I mean it. His name is Marv One, and he always wins. Mm -hmm. He's fucking genius. <laughs> that Rubio bar you put together, whoo! Man, that was the cleanest. Sometimes I just sit in admiration of the wordsmith that I'm teamed with. Yes. Mm -hmm. <sighs> mm -hmm. Admire him. Man. You so fucking nice. Mm -hmm. <laughs> when it come to grammar, he's its zenith. Hey, yo, on some real shit, I don't even know if I use that word right, y'all. <laughs> 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 but, but I guarantee he knows the meaning. I do. Yeah. I do. Did I use it right? Kind of. See what I mean? <laughs> shit. <laughs> you so fucking nice. I ought to say it twice. Fuck it. It, it. Yep. That's incredible. That's incredible. I ought to say it twice. I say it That's twice. Crazy. That's wild. Those shoes that, man, man, that whole fit lit. You are fucking debonair. Sharp as the tip of a sword on a cavalier. It's a pleasure with you just to have a beer, god damn it, here! Damn, <laughs> damn! <laughs> you're, not, you're, not, you're not gonna drink the beer? Oh, <laughs> to all y'all blind strangers, y'all would have thought that was rude, but no, no, he gotta drive later. Uh -oh. He's responsible. Okay. Oh, let's go. Okay. Beating him at words with friends? Impossible! Impossible, nigga. I'm lit. You know what? If you need somebody killed tonight, I got you, dude. I slide for you. Fuck it. If he get caught by the police, I'll run up and have a shootout with the cops for you. Boy, this is not for you. Remember, remember our Facebook memories, man? I've been sitting thinking about all the old stuff. Like, like when times got hard, and guess who showed up? This guy. Good friend, bro. <laughs> like when I owed Big Worm $200 and needed some weed money and some help just to get by. Mm -hmm. that's, that's Friday. Who showed up? That's Friday. This guy. Yeah, yeah, Friday. yeah. yeah. That's Friday. Like, like, like when Ricky got shot in the back in the alley. What? And we hopped in that convertible so we could what just ride. What are you talking about? This who the knows. fuck did I call? Oh, boys in the hood. Man, this guy! <laughs> that wasn't me, bro. What is <laughs> When I needed somebody to take one for the team, because I met that banging body chick with the thick thighs, who took one for the team? Y'all make some noise for this, this guy. guy. Let's go, man. Round two is on hard. Yeah. How nice you gonna be? Remember that time you made them salmon sliders? And you ain't use buns. Instead, you use Hawaiian rolls. That shit was fire. Culinary shit. And I was, I was super skeptical at first. Right. But then you was like, nah, try it, bro. And then I had one. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I got so inspired, yo, that I almost quit rapping and went to culinary school. What was in the recipe, bro? I'm just dying to know. It's um, salmon, aioli sauce. Can you write that down for me? All right, got it. <laughs> <laughs> I say, he raps fluidly. 
undefeated. He doesn't lose to me. If anybody calls him an op, they just abbreviate an opportunity. He's a pillar in the hood, never concealing when he's good. He doesn't see color. He sees people. And he wishes a Hitler would. He's a, <laughs> he's a humanitarian in a world that's too damn disparaging. He introduced me to elderberry and sea moss. So you know he just flew right through the variants. <laughs> the one, he's the one. He introduced me to the Matrix like Sean Marion. If, wow. That's crazy. That's crazy. That's crazy. Yeah, That's crazy. I'm nice. I said he's the one. Introduce me to the Matrix like Sean Marion. If you have a problem with anybody, I will bury them. Noisy next door neighbor, I'll bury them. Uber Eats driver stole your food, I'll bury them. See, the bottom line is you make me want to be a better Nick Af African American. You are the most underrated legend in this battle rapping thing of ours. Anytime you get booked, you're always bringing out the bars. Anytime you book an event, you're always bringing out the stars. Fucking Bitcoin legend. He got so many bands, I started bringing out guitars. Ooh. When he go play pickup ball, he control the gym. When he hits the lanes, he throws strikes. He don't even spare the bowling pins. I'm, I'm yeah. cold, I'm even cold. though you just met him, he'll make you feel like you never had an older friend. So now am I only giving you your flowers? I brought you something to roll them in. Uh, <laughs> roll this up. <laughs> Somebody roll this up. It's on quest. Oh, shit. <laughs> That was, man, man, some, somebody wrote that, for real. Oh, man. Talk to me nice. What you be putting in your beard to make it shine like that? <laughs> you don't wanna know. <laughs> No, 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 I mean for real. We've been friends for like 20 years. I still can't get mine like that. No, no, I'm, no, I'm, I'm fucking jealous. <laughs> if my beard did that, I would love it. I'd never cut it. You couldn't judge it. Please, bring a gavel. They'll laugh at you. Y'all ain't never did shit. No accomplishments. Raise your hand if you beat Eminem in a rap battle. Mm. <laughs> yeah. 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 <laughs> no, no, for real. For real. I ain't never had no friend quite like you in this life cycle. Some were tight high school buddies, but they more like rivals. Mm -hmm. You a king. You got big words for small prince what he writes Bible. Tanny, tanny passenger in his lane know the stature of his name and heights Eiffel. Despite trials and tribulations, you made it out. At 10 years old, you was the man in your house and there wasn't even a fucking man in your house. You made a route. You paved the way for the main stage with charm and wit. Whip a pill, but still wouldn't crack a smile for this slave trade. He paved ways, but wouldn't crack a smile for this slave trade. He stay paid just for kicks. He come around spinning like a Beyblade. He stood his ground in muddy water and still made waves. Y'all pay him some fucking respect. All his lines in y'all raps? What? Where y'all think y'all got the metaphors about the sports players with the numbers on their back? That's a fact. Facts. Facts. That's a fact. That's the God. That's the God. That's the <laughs> but on some real shit, I just figured you deserve more than a joke or two. I hope that you know that I'm focused, dude. The way you craft those rounds together are 
so notable, they quotables, and through the end, you helped me make it through. Them tough times, bro, I made it, dude, all because of you. So if you see a D over that navy blue, just know I'll be there to dig the grave with you. Let's go! Yes. Let's go, last round. It's on Mars. Man. Crazy. You talk, I love you, you man. You that's my friend. Crazy, that's bro. my fucking. That's my. Over. All jokes aside, mm -hmm. seeing you with your children gives me hope of one day being able to coach a tribe. I've been with you and watched you get it out the mud because you know that you gotta go provide. You've opened eyes. Never put a mask on with them. Never told them lies. And it's a couple other things I won't speak on, but you know that I know the vibes. Hold your shoulders high. Somebody chopping onions? <laughs> I, don't, I, don't, I don't think I'm supposed to cry. <laughs> but it's crazy. How you still kicking ass after all this time like Cobra Kai? Wow. Mm. That's crazy. That's crazy. You one of the coldest guys. I take pride in watching your children approach the sky. Because they watched you make life in the place where we were supposed to die. Yo, man, that's my friend! Hey, whoa, 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 whoa. whoa. That's my friend! Yo, I wasn't, I wasn't, Boy, I, wasn't I will beat you till you see through. I wasn't, I wasn't, <laughs> Boy, that's my friend! Yo, yo, yo. Let, let, what, is hap what is happening? Yo, just, what is happening? Just, that's my friend! No. I will no. beat you till you see through. What is happening? That's my friend! I will put a piranha down your throat <laughs> and then give you water until it eats you. I have no idea where you got a piranha from. That's my friend. What the hell did I, do? I will wrap your head up in plastic and then poke a hole in it with a needle for you to breathe through. Man, that's my friend. Hey, bro, you doing what? Man, I ain't trying to cheat you. That's my friend. What? I will get a job, bro. Okay. I will fill out an application. Hi, welcome to more. And whoop your ass before I greet you. Yeah. <laughs> what did I do? Like, what the hell, bro? No, fuck that. That's my friend. Do anything, bro. Yo. I will tell Will that you mentioned Jada and then bring them by to meet you! Yeah. Oh, man. That's my friend! Hey, hey, yo, man, I'm sorry, bro. Bro, gotta relax. No, bro, I'm trying to figure out what the fuss is about. You keep my friend name out your fucking <laughs> mouth! <laughs> That's my friend! <laughs> what the hell are y'all doing? It's my friend. My, yo, bro, bro, they get it. No, they don't. They gonna cut our fucking time. No, they won't. So you just, so you just gonna go up here off plan and just do whatever the fuck you want. Man, what fuck you mean I'm gonna do whatever the fuck I want? Nigga, you heard me. Oh, you supposed to be my best friend? <laughs> Shit, this how we moving? in front of all these motherfuckers. I done lost my fucking voice. And this what we doing? You know, the first time you said we was best friends, I was kind of tripping, right? <laughs> I, I, I was like, nah, maybe, maybe like, he ain't did enough. But you know what? We are best friends. And you know what else? What? I don't give a fuck. Yeah. I don't give a fuck about him uh -huh. or her uh -huh. or the dude holding the boom microphone. I don't give a fuck about who brought them cold ass pizzas in here. <laughs> Nigga. And I don't give a fuck about Rome. Bro. I'm the one you need to be worried about, partner. Yo, was Yo, was that was that Tupac? <clears throat> Juice? Yeah. <laughs> that, was, that, was, that was good, I could tell. Hey man, you be you you kind of be knowing your movie you, shit, bro. You did the vocals and shit. I ain't, I ain't know if it was so. something that I could sell. <laughs> so, so, so they got us on a show called The Nicest, and we the nicest. How could that fail? 
it won't. You know why? I guess because we complement each other well. Ah. Yeah. Ah. Broke the fucking internet. <laughs> Fuck just happened. And I broke my voice box. Like I literally, um, right now, um, I sound like I'm on one of those don't smoke cigarettes. <laughs> Yo, I don't think you can say that. That's crazy. They got like holes in their necks, bro. Oh, I don't know if it's anybody who knows. <laughs> Like, I didn't mean it like that. Like, I meant it like... The chemistry's incredible, yeah. Marv. I feel like before the battle, you kind of misled us, making it seem like you weren't going to be as nice as you were. Have you ever seen Lucky Number 11? That's what we call the Kansas City Shuffle. Oh, that was the KC Shuffle right there. KC Shuffle. And it landed. It landed incredibly. Oh, and, uh, you know, because we have such a, a tenure as being a team, we wanted to showcase what we do better than everybody else. And it was definitely his idea because I was against it at first. I was just being lazy with the writing. But I'm glad, you know what I'm saying, that he stuck to his guns. And I think it, I think it turned out really fucking good. Because like, when we dropped and we were battling and they didn't know it was a, a compliment battle, everybody went crazy. He started getting messages. I mean, I sold my <clears throat> People were threatening us. They're literally my best friend. Like, so here's the thing. With Battle Rap, there are so many avenues that we can explore from stand-up, improv, poetry, rap, acting, dancing. <laughs> and he did not do our fourth round. We were gonna break out in the dance. We had a whole crew. And you ever seen Bring It On? I'm not gonna front. I'm really upset that two men in this room was like, oh yeah, I've seen Bring It On. <laughs> That's wild. Um, it was very easy for me to compliment my best friend, you know what I'm saying? So, like, I was super happy with the opportunity to to, to let the world know how I genuinely feel about him and his talent and how he is as a person and a parent and all that. Like, yo, this is my friend, this is my best friend. Yeah. Hey, man, hey, man, you're a nice guy, man. You're a stand-up yeah. dude, man. You talk me out of bullshit. Our uh, rappers drop your style. You freshly dressed, yeah. man. The numbers on the jersey, man. Just saying, bro. I'm just saying. Catch 20 in your back yeah. like Barry yeah. Sanders. It's like, bro. that's... White this motherfucker is handsome as hell. You have one of the greatest minds. You influential. People see you, they want to be you. They soak it up. I show my Jewish mom your battle. She's like, damn, cuz that shit was hard as fuck. <laughs>